Willkommen zurück! Wir sind da, wo wir aufgehört haben, bei Dream Daddy. Und ich glaube, wir gehen jetzt auch einfach mal direkt weiter. Denn... Ja, was passiert uns noch so Schönes? <lacht> also, legen wir mal los. I get to work unpacking the various boxes around the living room. A couple hours pass and I get some good work done. The washer dry unit is both washing and drying and we can actually walk through the living room without tripping over boxes. Wow, vorbildlich. First visitor already. I walk over to the door and open it. Hello. A handsome, clean-cut man stands at my door, brandishing a plate of cookies. Oh, Kekse, ich nehme auch welche. Hello. <laughs> hey. Oh, where are my manners? My name is Joseph. I'm your next door neighbor. Er sieht auch einfach aus wie so ein Joseph, ne? Also, jetzt nichts gegen die Josephs auf dieser Welt, aber... You, you get it. <laughs> Oh, yes. Hi, I'm Lloyd. That's what my name is. <laughs> I'm a bit startled here. Oh. I saw the moving van and thought I'd bring over some cookies. My daughter Christy wanted me to let you know she baked them herself. Ah. Joseph leans in and whispers. Oh. But between you and me, she just sprinkled in the chocolate chips. <laughs> nice. <laughs> We both share a laugh. Kids, right? Hey. Wow, cookies, huh? So nice to meet you. Joseph hands her the plate of cookies with a smile. Schade, dass es keine gezeichnete dazu gibt. Also, das, das fände ich noch schöner. Hmm. Dot, dot, dot. Ah. Well, thanks for the cookies. More McDonald's. Oh, McDonald's. <laughs> nice. Amanda disappears with the cookies. Falls ich übrigens überbelichtet bin, Lichtsituation. Ich krieg das noch raus, aber ich habe gerade Lust hier äh, aufzunehmen. Also von daher. <lacht> okay. Amanda, come and she's gone. <lacht> That's my daughter. Her name is Amanda. She's a charmer. Daughters are tough. Sons are also tough. Children in general are just tough. I hear that. I mean, there have to be something wrong with you to, tr to try raise more than two. <laughs> I have four kids. <laughs> What have you done? Oh, um, I meant... Oh. Don't worry, you didn't mean to be rude. Oh no, this is the first neighbor I've met and my social life is already in a tailspin. I wonder if it's too late to move again. <laughs> Actually, it's a second neighbor, weil ich habe ja schon Brian kennengelernt. Der uh, ist ja im Park und hat mir erzählt, dass er auch in der Gegend wohnt. Also Übersetzungsfehler. Uh, nein, es ist kein Übersetzungsfehler. Es ist einfach nur, ja, es ist ein bisschen technisch nicht korrekt. Uh, yeah, okay. Is the Mrs. around? Ah, the Mrs. Mister, actually, and uh, no, not anymore. He died. Oh. Uh, I'm sorry for your loss. No, no, it's it's all right. Wow, this is uncomfortable. <laughs> we stand there quietly for a moment, acutely wait, aware of how awkward we both made things. Well, that escalated quickly. Mm. I'm sorry, can you close the door real quick? I look at Joseph quizzically but comply. After a second I hear a knock on the door. Opening it, I see Joseph standing there with a huge smile. Uh -huh. Hey, I'm your new neighbor, Joseph. I promise to not talk about your dead spouse this time. I'm throwing a barbecue for the cul-de-sac and I'd love for you to come by and meet the rest of the neighbors in our community. What do you say, pal? Well, he got a nice second start. <laughs> That sounds great. My daughter Amanda and I would love to stop by. Also, four kids is a perfectly normal amount of children to have. We shake hands to seal the deal. Right. Well, neighbor, I'll see you at 3 p.m. sharp on Saturday. Sure thing, neighbor. Joseph starts walking away but stops to think for a second and turns around. Hey, in all seriousness, raising a kid on your own can't be easy. If you ever need to 
talk about stuff. I am the youth minister at a church down the street. Ooh, <laughs> church boy. Oh, I, I don't know. I wouldn't really consider myself a youth. Yeah. You look pretty young to me, but suit yourself. And with that, Joseph's gone. He seemed nice. Amanda walks back into the living room, crumbs on her face and cookie in her in hand. This könnte ich sein. Ich liebe Kekse. <laughs> that was the smoothest recover I've ever seen. I should be taking notes. Yeah. See, you're already fitting in great. Where'd those cookies go? Oh. They're gone. I'm sorry. <laughs> <lacht> ja. Oh man, ja, leg, leg mir mal so eine Packung Kekse hin und ich... <lacht> weg sind sie, ne? If it makes you feel any better, they were very good. So you ate all of them anyway. <lacht> das ist so gut. <lacht> I guess that makes it break time. Any ideas? I could use some coffee. Joseph probably wants his plate back. Jo, entweder wir rennen ihm direkt hinterher oder wir machen uns erstmal einen Kaffee. Ich glaube, ich mache mir erstmal einen Kaffee. I'm feeling, feeling a little sluggish and coffee seems like the more responsible option than just taking a nap. I'm proud of you. Thank you. Oh man. Ach so, wir kochen uns keinen Kaffee. Wir gehen direkt in den Coffee Shop. Alles klar, natürlich. Äh, hab's vergessen, Amerika. Okay. We walk down the street to the coffee spoon, a cute little place on the corner. Man, this is in such convenient walking distance from our place. I mean, I guess. What's wrong? Why would I go somewhere else and drink coffee on a couch when I could just drink better coffee at home on my own couch and not have to make awkward eye contact? Contact with other people. That's what I'm saying. Ich meine, warum will ich einfach zu Hause einen Kaffee? Aber bestimmt treffen wir gleich wieder ein. Ich wette es. At least when I'm when I'm home, some random guy isn't gonna come up and sit on the recliner next to me. And I won't feel like a little weird about it because technically he's not sitting at my table, but he is very much within my personal zone. Dead. And what's the etiquette when you have a dirty mug? Is there a bin? Do you go set it up on the counter because you don't know where else to put it? Or do you leave it there and feel your face flush hot with shame as you consider the possibility that there's in fact a bin somewhere just out of sight and now you're the dead jerk who left their mug? Uh. Dad, are you just afraid to meet new people? <laughs> yes, I guess he is. <laughs> oh my god, eh? Yes, Amanda! <laughs> We walk inside. <laughs> Sag ich doch, das ist bestimmt der nächste. Ich glaube, den habe ich auf dem Bild gesehen. The inside of the coffee shop is incredibly warm and inviting. Vinyl records line the walls and patrons, patrons lunch, lounge around on well-worn in couches. Some cool tunes spin on a record player next to a little stage. Oh, ist richtig vintage, ist richtig cool. Welcome to the coffee shop. Uh, coffee spoon. Guys, how it's going? How's it going? Oh man, how's it going? What's with the name? Oh, it's um, it's kind of dumb. It gets mentioned in this poem I like, and I thought it was a good idea at the time, and I suppose now it's still a good idea because like the business is still running. <laughs> But people ask me the question all the time, and I give them the same answer every time. And now I'm standing here rambling, and I'm sure we're all getting more and more uncomfortable the more I keep talking. But man, we're in it now, and I can't stop. <laughs> oh, I feel that. So, what'll it be? I scan the chalkboard menu and am immediately overwhelmed. I'll have a... Godspeed you, black coffee. <laughs> Ice Tegan and Sarah, Chai and Ward. Black coffee it is. My guy is a black coffee guy. Ich meine, habt ihr euch mal angeguckt? Def definitiv schwarzer Kaffee. A classic. Oh, Herzchen. Schön. <laughs> I don't get it. 
<laughs> oh, it's a pun! Godspeed you! Black Emperor is a really amazing and influential progressive rock band known for their sweeping soundscapes and... <laughs> I'm doing the thing again! <laughs> but coming right up! And for you? I'll have a macchiato de Marco, please. Was auch immer das sein soll. Coming right up. Do you want it in small, medium or biggie smalls? Was ist in biggie smalls? Wer hat sich das dort ausgedacht? Uh, medium? Wait, is biggie smalls big or small? Ja, yeah, genau, das habe ich mir auch gerade gefragt. Um, I should change that, shouldn't I? <laughs> <laughs> Matt sets to making our drinks and Amanda and I take a seat on one of the couches. What's his deal? Let the man make his puns. They're cooler bands than... Moment. They're cooler bands than you listen to anyway. Hey! Hey! Scar was cool once! This couch is actually pretty comfy. Maybe not comfier than our couch, but it's alright. Good lumber support. You sink right into it. Yes. Okay, it's it's comfier than our couch. Amanda nudges me. <laughs> this place is right next to our house and that guy seems not only cool, but also just as uncomfortable with talking to other people as you are. This is echt cool, wenn da ein Barista arbeitet, der nicht so gut mit dem Sprechen. Also, ja, ja, ich habe jetzt auch gerade das Problem. <lacht> Der einfach nicht gut damit ist, mit anderen Leuten zu sprechen. Das ist so hm, schwierig, aber machbar, würde ich sagen. You should totally become friends with him. Ich habe ja schon Herzchen von ihm gekriegt. Also, ich weiß nicht, ob ich die Herzchen gesehen habe, aber ich als Spieler habe die Herzchen gesehen. Uh, I don't know. Come on, what do we say about meeting new people? I can't meet new people if I always stay inside and also don't go outside and also don't talk to people. See, we're making progress. Matt sets our drinks down at our table and I immediately burn the roof of my mouth. Ow, just fees. That is my nicht. Good one. <laughs> Hi, when you're in the neighborhood, I'm Amanda and this is my dad, Lloyd. Hey. Oh, right on. Pleased to meet you, Bill. Hey. You ought to come by when my daughter's hang around the shop. You two might get along. Warum haben die alle Töchter? Ich meine, okay, Joseph hat vier Kinder. Irgendwie sprechen die alle nur für ihre Töchter. Das ist... Hmm, I sense a pattern. Okay. Yeah, I'm sure we'll be... Uh, we'll maybe come in from time to time. Amanda kicks my leg from under the tip. Ow! I'm sure we'll be in here a lot. You know what? Let me get you guys' opinion on something. Matt goes into the bag and comes out with a fresh plate of something that smells amazing. I'm working on a new banana bread recipe and I need help coming up with a name for it. Well, I think we're gonna have to taste it first so we can uh, get the full flavor profile of, you know, and really appreciate the flavor sensations of Amanda not so vigorously. She knows this game. Yeah, we need to give the Nana Brother a taste if you want us doing free creative labor. I think it would be commensurate with, uh, I've taught her well, we have trained for this day. I was just gonna give you guys banana bread, uh, free banana bread anyway. Right. Yes. That. <laughs> Matt serves us each a piece. Amanda and I happily chow down. This is amazing! Thanks, the secret ingredient is bananas. Oh dear. <laughs> so, any ideas? I'm stumped. Well, I think I might only be able to give you dead ba band puns, but I'll give it a shot. Banana bread Kennedy's, grateful banana bread, right set banana bread, right set kung fu, right set Fred. Uh, banana bread Kennedy's sagt mir nichts, and great grateful banana bread sagt mir auch nichts. Ja, yeah, nehme ich das, das kenne ich. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Like right said, Fred. But n now it's about banana bread. I think the youngsters would like it despite not getting it. <laughs> that actually has a nice ring to it. Really? 
Yeah! Right side banana bread! Strong decision! That's art, baby! I wanted to say baby because I thought it would sound cool, but once I said it, I realized that it just doesn't sound good coming out of my mouth and maybe I should just leave saying baby to the professionals. Oh. <laughs> hey. Enjoy your coffee! Thanks, baby. <laughs> See, it sounds good when you say it. Totally flirting with me. Across the way a man catches my eye. He sits by himself, brooding over a cup of coffee. Our eyes meet just for a moment. Oh, that's the with the Lederjacke. I have keine Ahnung von den Namen, ne? Ich hab, ich hab das vorher nie gespielt. Drei Fragezeichen. Dot, dot, dot. I hastily look away, hoping he didn't catch me staring. Who's that? We finish up our drinks and head out. Thanks for stopping in. Take care. Okay, now that we're full of caffeine, where to? I need a nap. We just had coffee. Ja, noch nicht, nichts von dem Neppuccino gehört. <laughs> Have you ever known me to play by the rules? Your father's a rebel, sweetie. Now all aboard the train to Sleepy Time Junction. <laughs> Ah, uh, ich, ich, ich mag den Protagonisten. Protagonisten, der, der ist echt... Der hat gute Lines. <lacht> As we're walking home, I hear heavy footsteps come up behind us. Lloyd! Bro! Hey. I turn around and I'm greeted by a familiar face jogging up to us. Where kid der mich? Ich bin doch erst hier gezogen. <lacht> Craig? Bro! Bro. <lacht> Holy, wow, I haven't seen Craig in forever. It's been too long, dude. Yeah, wow, well, you look great. Hey. <laughs> yeah, I cleaned up my act. Cleaned up his act? Are you kidding me? He's ripped. <laughs> Amanda, this is my friend Craig. Nicht Craig? Craig. <laughs> we went to college together. We were roommates for a while, too. <laughs> Amanda, dude, you probably don't remember me, but you're so big now. <laughs> Hello and hello cute baby. Ich, ich finde das Gesicht von dem Baby, das ist echt... Diese Augen. <lacht> Dad, why are you running so fast? <lacht> ah, thank you. Last time I saw you, I think you were about her size. This is River. Say hi, River. Wieder eine Tochter übrigens. <lacht> He picks up her tiny wrist and waves it around. River gurgles happily. Are you... Babysitting? <laughs> nah, dude. River's my kid. Man, it has been a long time. Feels like one minute we're rolling up to exams with bad hangovers and the next we're both fathers. Where you been, man? I was working out in California and just relocated the business back to Maple Bay. <laughs> no kidding. A man and I just moved to this side of town. How's Smashly doing? Smashly? When is it Smashly? <laughs> Oh mein Gott! Oder, oder, okay. Wer nennt sein Kind Smashly? Das ist das viel wichtiger. I don't know. <laughs> I mean Ashley. Ashley is her name. I... She actually still goes by Smashly and uh, we got divorced last year. Oh dude, I'm so sorry. Nice. It's old news. We take turns taking care of River and the twins. It's all Cooper Kitty Cooper City. Ich weiß nicht mal, was das heißt. Moment, <lacht> da muss ich mal kurz nachschlagen. Ich, das kann ich jetzt nicht so stehen lassen. Copacetic. In bester Ordnung ausgezeichnet, sagt das Wörterbuch. Okay, dann nehmen wir das mal so hin. Twins? You have three kids? Ain't life something, bro, right? Kekstan Craig. Kekstan Craig is a father. Oh, three! Kekstan Craig? Craig? Oh, oh <laughs> yeah, it was my old college nickname. He got it because he did a lot of Kekstans. Was sind denn jetzt schon wieder Kekstans? Äh, schlag ich jetzt nicht, ne? <laughs> ah, okay. It's that thing where you do a handstand on a keg and then drink from the keg. Klingt nicht so gesund. Right. <laughs> he was very good at it. 
Nah, bro, I hate to be that guy, but I'm in the middle of my daily jog and I really gotta keep up my heart rate. Brought River along for, you know, resistance training. <laughs> oh, hellish. You jog daily? I jog yearly. <laughs> On January 1st, when I promised myself that I'm gonna jog daily for the rest of the year, but give up after 30 minutes and just walk home. Ulich ein bisschen. Well, it's never too late to get back into it, dude. You should join me sometime. Haha, <laughs> I, I don't know. Come on, it'd be fun. We could grab breakfast afterwards. Catch up. We could do a bro brunch like the good. <laughs> bro brunch? Ich, ich hätte gern Bro Brunch mit dir. Alles klar. Alright, sure, sounds great. Oh. Right, let's get that going soon. I better get moving. Good to see you guys. Craig gives a little wave, puts his earbuds back in and jogs off. I can't believe Craig is ripped and has kids. I'm reeling. <laughs> What's that? The Craig I knew is not fit to be responsible for any living thing, including and especially himself. One time I watched him drink an entire jar of marinara sauce for dinner. Ew! Amanda, he opened up a new jar of marinara sauce and then he drank it like it was a thing that normal people do. It was unholy. And then I asked him what the hell he was doing and he said, and I quote, It's basically a smoothie, bro. <laughs> I mean, technically... He's not wrong. He jogs. He was jogging. <laughs> He's like a totally different person. Anyway, we better get home. I'll have plenty of time to reflect on how old I feel later. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Amanda and I flop down on the couch. Amanda has to shove, shove some empty boxes out of the way before she can sit. Ich dachte, es stehen nicht mehr so viele Boxen rum. Naja. Aber immer noch vor der Couch. Gerade da, wo es eigentlich am interessantesten ist, die wegzuräumen. Oh. <laughs> Too bad we're gonna be putting my stuff right back into these boxes in a few months. No, don't say that. Aww. Oh, Dad, it's gonna be okay. I'll be fine. I know, I know. It's just... You're my little girl. It's gonna be weird not having you around. I'll come visit. And I'll text you every day. And I'll take lots of pictures. I mean, obviously, I'm a photography major. You promise? Of course. Are you gonna be okay by your lonesome? Oh, come on. I'll be fine. I'll get a dog or something. Yeah, bin ich auch dabei. Ich würde mir auch einen Hund holen. A dog! Forget art school, I still... I'll just stay for the dog. <laughs> yeah, fühle ich. Is that what it's gonna take? Medium-sized dog. Handkerchief around the neck. I get to name it. That's what it will cost for me to give up on my dreams. I'm a woman of simple wants and needs. <laughs> well, a dog is a lot cheaper than college. <laughs> Amanda laughs. Oh. <laughs> Suddenly a pile of envelopes slides through the mail slot. Speaking of college... Yeah. Amanda darts over to the envelopes and shuffles through them. She pulls one out and throws the rest back on the floor. This is from McGovern College of Art and Design. Open it. Hmm. But I'm scared. It's just an envelope. Hmm. Yeah, it's just like my entire future. Not a big deal. Huh. She takes a deep breath and rips the letter open with her teeth. With her teeth. Can't comment. <laughs> We have a letter opener, but okay. <laughs> I hold my breath while Amanda's eyes start back and forth, scanning the letter. What does it say? Uh, the admission comi committee has reviewed your application, blah blah blah. Um, we... Her face drops. Regret to inform you that we are unable to offer you admission to McGowan College of Art and Design. Oh, I'm Amanda. Amanda throws the letter on the coffee table. Oh, sweetie. It's okay. I kind of saw it coming. I knew I shouldn't have put it experimental stuff in my portfolio. The admission officer told me they just want to see portraits or whatever. I pull Amanda in for a big hug. Ah, best out of the year. 
You're an amazing photographer. I know how much work you put into your portfolio. Some other school is gonna want to snatch you up for sure. Hmm. Yeah, I know. It's fine. Are you actually fine or are you just saying that? Hmm. I'm fine. Really. Her face says the opposite, but I probably shouldn't push her on this. <laughs> ich wollte auch gerade sagen, dass ihr Gesicht was anderes sagt, aber gut, dass, dass ich und mein Dad uns da einig sind. Hmm. Oh, and before I forget, Emma R and Emma P are sleeping over tonight. Wir sind doch gerade so gezogen, Mann! So... You need me out of the way because I'm painfully uncool. I would choose more delicate phrasing, but... Yes. Well, I'll have you know that I conveniently already have plans for tonight, so you have the new place to yourself. Was soll ich denn für Pläne? Sprich mit mir! Yeah, what are your plans? Quick, think of plans! Yeah, yeah! <laughs> I am secretly the mayor of this town. Gotta attend the union meeting. I'm going clubbing. I'm going clubbing. I'm gonna put on a nice outfit and go tear it up on the dance floor. All the hottest dance moves. The lawnmower, the sprinkler, the running man, you know, the ones all the kids these days are doing. I have noch nie von diesen moves gehört. Alright, but I'm not gonna come pick you up if you pull anything this time. Not again. I'm just kidding. I'm actually going to... <laughs> go to bed. <laughs> go out and watch the game. Ja, komm, wir versuchen es nochmal. Vielleicht geht er ja wirklich raus. Nice. <lacht> Which game? You know, the game. The one that's on tonight. The game on TV. At somewhere other than here. <lacht> okay, cool. While you do that, I'm gonna do drugs and commit some light arson with the Emmas. <lacht> oh, so eine schöne Tochter, ey. <lacht> I'm concerned you're hanging with the wrong crowd. Amanda shrugs. <laughs> I would have expected you guys to be up to white collar crime by this point. Maybe money laundering at least. I'm a street rat, Pops. <laughs> You're kidding about doing drugs and crime, right? Plötzlich ist er sich nicht mehr so sicher. Yes, Dad. <laughs> Just making sure. <laughs> I give her a pat on the head. Ah, pat pat. <laughs> have fun with your sports. Are you being sarcastic? <sighs> No, making fun of sports is played out. Hmm. Alright then. I do some light cleaning around the house and decide to clear out right before Amanda's friends arrive. Before I leave, Amanda stops me. Huh. Hey, don't forget that you have that meeting with my English teacher tomorrow. Oh, right, Mr. Vega. Yep, totally remembered. I'll be there. Cool. <laughs> Okay, ähm, ja, dann erstmal bis hierhin und äh, dann mal sehen, was äh, in der Sp Sportsbar passiert, sofern ich eine finde, weil äh, ich habe gerade schon gelesen, dass ähm, er gar nicht weiß, wo er hin soll. <lacht> Aber gut, das äh, machen wir dann beim nächsten Mal. Ich hoffe, es hat dir Spaß gemacht und äh, ich freue mich schon aufs nächste Mal. Bis dahin, ciao!